Stranger Jimmy and I are betrothed. How dare you? How dare you save me? What? What? I, I stayed up with you all night. I make sure you recover. This is how you thank I me? I curse you. How could you do this to your son? Oh. You know what? I should have left you die. I should have told the elders what you did. They would have taken you out of your stinking misery. Well, I would welcome that with open arms. Oh, really? Well, then I'll just go tell them right now. Go ahead. I will. Oh! Oh, the back. You always go for the back. <laughs> How you like them apples? All I'm saying is, this word betrothed, does that mean that we're going steady now? Because, I mean, frankly, I think that's even rushing it a bit. But if, if you think that it means we're gonna get married, well, we can't. Look, I, I'm too young. She's way too young. And we hardly even know each other. But you know all there is to know about me. Oh. He does, does he? Okay, now this is all just a big misunderstanding, okay, guys? You be not worthy of me. Slit your throat. I could have done so during the night had I wanted to. You took away my husband. Give me a son. I shall do you the honor and marry you. Gladly. No, really, it's okay. By faith, I shall make you happy. Look, no offense or anything, but let's pretend like this never happened, okay? Be that the way of the heaven sent. Boy, faith not. You did what? I said yes. Well, well, what's so wrong with that? We may never get out of here. All the plans, they don't sound so good, you know? So, I might as well be comfortable. Besides, he loves me. He said so. You love him? I admire him. He'll protect me. It's not enough reason to marry him here. What, were you in that wine last night, too? No. <sighs> Unlike some I know. What? She said yes. She's gonna marry Elder Cole. Good for her. Don't ask.
back with him. Thank you. I can't stay. Ah, yes. You must ready yourself for the ceremony. Elder Cole, the last thing I want to do is hurt you. But I can't marry you. Please, let me finish. Since Renato died, I've had a lot of time to think. Renato discovered me. He told me I could sing. He paid for my lessons, guided my career. He gave me confidence. I was very grateful to him. I was afraid I couldn't live without him. So I married him. But you loved him. No. I didn't marry for love. I needed someone to take care of me. But I don't need that now. I can look after myself. So the next time I marry, it won't be for someone to look after me. It will be for love. And you have not that feeling now I care about you. I do. But it isn't love. You may leave now. What's the soonest we can leave this place? I got a certain IRA parent after me. We gotta go. We just gotta be very careful. I mean, how was I supposed to know the rules would be a little bit different around here? We gotta get out of here. Look, I know that. Okay, I mean, it's just taking a little bit longer than I thought. Oh, it's about time that you're back. I want to go home. Right on, man. What do you say, Andrew? You promised. I know. I did. It's okay. I'm going with you. For as much as these chosen have consented together before the Almighty and by the joining of hands, I now proclaim that all should be man and wife together for all men. For all men. 